And welcome back. The SWAC Women's Basketball Tournament beginning in Birmingham today for Alabama A&M. They took on Grambling State. Lady Bulldogs getting off to a quick start on the fast break. Nigeria Jones pushes it up court to Dariana Lewis. She gets the easy two right here. Bulldogs up by four. Grambling responds. Alexis Holtz drives to the paint, throws up the floater, and it's good. Back and forth we go. Lewis squares up and sinks the jumper from the free throw line. Check out this stat line. 21 points, 20 rebounds for her as AM led by one at the break. Second half we go. Here comes Grambling. Alexis Holtz with the off-balance shot, and it is good for the Lady Tigers. Later on, Holt kicks it out to Justice Coleman, and she buries the three-pointer to extend the Lady Tigers' lead. Excuse me. AM trying to keep it close. Darian Bergen taking it coast to coast. She'll get the bucket and one. Lady Bulldogs down by three. But AM making too many mistakes down the stretch, and GSU took full advantage. Holt puts the game on ice right here with this bucket, and Grambling State eliminates Alabama AM by final of 58 to 50. After the game, Coach Margaret Richards talked to us about the mistakes that were made down the stretch. Uh, again, I think we was extremely undisciplined. You know, again, we had wide open transition. Uh, baskets and we turned it over that was very unfortunate and that's that's unacceptable so I mean we have we know better than that we work on transition all the time but we, we did not execute and it, I think that cost us a game the momentum shifted and that really cost us we also we just have to know that we have to be disciplined on offense especially when we only have um, a limited number of people if we're all not on the same page it messes everything up it can't be six people on the same page and one not can't be four on the same page and three not we all have to work together and try to figure out a way to get what we want. And tonight, I don't feel that we did that on the offensive end. And that'll do it for the WZDX Sports Report on this Thursday evening. I'm Mo Carter. Let's send it back to Connor in the studio.